السلام علیکم و رحمت اللہ و برکاتہ آم الطاف الرحمن رومی آئی سے سلام تو ایچ آل آف یو اور آم ہیئے تو دے ویت انہا نیو ویڈیو اٹس اباوٹ ای ویڈی بگ ڈیمانڈ اباوٹ ای ویڈی بگ ویلیو اباوٹ ای ویڈی بگ امپورٹنس آف اسٹیبلشمنٹ آف انگلیش ٹی وی چینلز ای پرومننٹ انگلیش ٹی وی چینلز but not a single English TV channel. It must be so many here in our country. Uh, because we are facing the bad, the very negative consequences due to the non-availability of English TV networks here in our country. Uh, if we will keenly observe that we are living in a global world. And this global world is actually a global village. And we have a very close links which each other who are living surrounding of our country or who are living um, in somewhere else but we are actually living in a global village so the information and the matters which are going to be happen inside of our country they are fortunate or unfortunate they are positive or they are negative it must be conveyed to other people as well who are living out of this country. Just like if we will compare ourselves with India, uh, the India has actually uh, 902, totally 902 TV channels. And there's no doubt that the India is seven times bigger than us from every aspect. The population is much more uh, than us. But even then, they have totally 902 TV channels in English. And out of that, they have only 94 English TV channels, which are purely running in English. Just like this, by utilizing the platform of that English TV channels, they are provoking a very baseless controversies against Pakistan. They are always twisting, perverting and hardening the truth and they are always provoking the baseless news against Pakistan. And still, and still, I will say here, being a responsible citizen, that we and our ruler and everyone here in Pakistan, we want actually peace because we are Muslim. And Islam is the religion of peace and harmony. Islam never teach you about the uh, barbarianness, about the despoticness, about to kill the innocent people. These are not the teaching of Islam. So we are Muslim. So we definitely want peace with our neighbors and all the countries in the world, even with India. If India will stop to destabilize Pakistan, to create problems inside of Pakistan, then definitely uh, I'm pretty much sure that our politicians and our leaders and everyone will want peace with India. But India is always provoking negative propagandas against Pakistan, negative and baseless news about Pakistan. Now, how can we will be able to justify our position contrary to the India? because we don't have the English TV platforms here. And I can't deny that we don't have talented people here. We don't have intellectual people here. We have, yes, we have very famous and very talented, very intellectual kind of journalists uh, like um, Hamid Mir, like um, Salim Safi, like Urshad Sharif, like Do uh, Dr. Danish, like Imran Khan, one of my favorite journalists, uh, there are so many Wasim Badami, but they are speaking in Urdu. They are always elaborating, they are always highlighting the issues, the real issues. Yes, there is no doubt, it's not questionable even. You know, they are, they are talking, they are making their program, they are arranging their program upon the international issues, upon Kashmir, upon Palestine, upon Afghanistan, upon something else but unfortunately they are very fluently very logically very rationally they are speaking in English and 
it's not going to be work out anymore and now this is the time if you people are agreed with me that we have to convey this message first of all to the government to the broadcasting and information department and then all those people who would like to invest in this sector they should introduce they should establish a well organized english tv channel well prominent english tv channels and then you know it must create so many jobs as well because we have many talented people here in pakistan they know everything they can explain everything they can present everything but they don't have the platform if the if government and all the those people who can afford who can sustain this facility they should think about this if you agree with me just help me to share this message with the government thank you so much assalamu alaikum